y'all. So I'm here at Buckingham Fountain and um, I want this to be the start of the vlog because tomorrow is travel day and um, I want this to be the intro or whatever. But Buckingham Fountain, I haven't been here in like years. So it's, it feels really great to come back here. Um, there's the, and there's, it's like they're having some sort of festival. It looks really cool. But tomorrow I'm going to Wild Adventures, going to Atlanta. So let this be the beginning. Buckingham Palace, Buckingham, not Buckingham Palace, Buckingham Fountain. You've been great. I got plenty of footage, so I might post it on my YouTube or just do something like that. So that's gonna be pretty epic. But it actually feels really great to see Chicago actually have tourists again, because I came back in like 2020, it was like, these whole streets were like dead. But now it's full of tourism and I'm glad because Chicago needs but I'm starting to head out. Tomorrow is going to be the busy day. Going to Atlanta and going to Wild Adventures. So let's just see. So we about to uh, get out and go to Atlanta. Just to start the summer, the first day of summer. Yep, well, well technically. Yep. And where are we going today? We're going to Wild Adventures. Yep. Wild Adventures. Yep. And, and fun spot. Front spots tomorrow. We I know. Do another video tomorrow. No, it's gonna be the same video. You gotta stop. It. Let's get it. Okay. hours now and we decided to stop at Buggies. I yes. only been to the one in Alabama and that was really I, I was kind of underwhelmed but this place does not disappoint you know. So oh, we finally here after nearly six years of wanting to come here. I'm here. I'm finally fucking here. I'm so excited. This is a park I've been wanting to go that's in my state. I've been living in this state for so long. I have not been. So, let's begin my adventure. About to get on this right here um i actually what's so funny is that back in the day i used to actually put this in my parks back in um roller coaster tycoon it's a game about building roller coasters basically that's it but um i'm actually this has been a really fun time actually uh, i got on um outpost express which is a uh, vacoma junior kitty coaster we got on um swamp thing and got on um what you call it? What's that ride called? Uh, Swamp Water Snake or something. And Go Bananas. Go Bananas is trash. Let's just say that out of the blue, but that's going. Sorry if you hear your screams, but you know, I'm gonna ride Boomerang next. But you know, surprisingly the park, well the actual rides itself don't have long waits. I've been walking on pretty much everything. Holy crap. Uh, that looks so much fun. I'm gonna put y'all away and ride this.
doing boomerang over there. Uh, let's just say I lost my right contact right here. So I'm pretty much blind in this eye. But uh, this park is really, really beautiful. Like I'm genuinely surprised how beautiful it is. But it is owned by the same people who own Dollywood and Silver Dollar City. But um, I'm about to do Twisted Typhoon. And then I'm probably just gonna walk around here do some flat rides. And the SNS drop tower is actually open. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Big Drop, or whatever your name is at Stratosphere. I'm talking to you. Scott, uh, I'm about to get on this SLC. Well, okay, here's the thing. If they were looking for someone's glasses, everybody left a line. Now it has no line. And I got on, let's just say it's my favorite non b and invert. Inverted or suspended coaster. I'm sorry about this. Okay. But yeah, it's super, super good. But I'm gonna go. Just taking some off-ride videos of this um because i'm literally soaked and it's really the only thing i can do because i you know i keep hearing noises because i saw a lizard over there i don't know but um yeah this ride is good really really elite y'all enthusiasts hate this so much i don't <laughs> i will say though this park does have the worst coaster on human earth not gonna name names but it's go bananas it should be called go to fucking hell because that's how bad it is off with boomerang absolutely amazing it's not as good as st louis but it's i noticed those towers are way steeper than really any boomerang i've ridden but this ride is so good any night off with boomerang coming back here first thing in the morning tomorrow to ride some more so yeah ending the day off at wild adventures we've been wanting to come here for nearly six years and it was amazing what's your thoughts on it i loved it it was you know, spacious, with one long, one long line, different types of rides. The water Browser. park was crowded, but everything else didn't have long waits. And he enjoyed it. Yeah, I did. And it's actually really pretty. It's a really pretty park. Probably be back tomorrow. It was well designed. It wasn't a bunch of uh, hills or anything, so it was well done. <laughs> All right. No. We're going to end it off with day two.